Obviously money is a big deal, so today I'm going to worry a bit about workshops as well. But for now, I want to try and get the infirmary and the solitary area set up. Now this was actually meant to be concrete, that was one stylized thing I wanted to worry about. But I completely forgot, so that's my bad. So I'm going to have a look at finance, and we're going to, sorry, grants rather, and we're going to see what we got. What have we got? We've already activated the one for the Water Wonderland, which... You know, I could do, but it's kind of silly. I don't have the money for it anyway, so... Whatever. Uh, bookworm, we don't have a simple common room yet. How much would that area cost to build foundation-wise? That's $910. That's... That gets you halfway there. So, you know what? I'm just gonna invest in it wherever it went. Uh... Simple common room, a few books and some chairs. Okay, yeah, that's cool. Uh, built two chairs. I built them somewhere, didn't I? Yeah, I did. Um, yeah, the offices. See, that's, that's you know, that's fine. Grants mod doesn't really pick up on the fact that they're in the office, but that's cool. And then as well, we're going to want to put a door in. I'll get this um, grant out of the way. Sorry, I just put a regular door. No, it's a prison. Sorry, it's a common room, so everyone can go in there. Uh, that'll get that built and everything will be pretty good. Morgue, don't need to worry about it yet. Storage, not yet. Uh, yeah, I think we're, we're pretty good with all of that going on. So I might zone this up now. And I've lost the button. It was there. Uh, I need to wait. Awesome. But yeah, okay, let's get on to the topic of Alpha 12. Now, I have been keeping an eye on uh, Chris DeLay's, um, or pretty much Interversion Software's uh, business uh, side of things. They actually have a, a channel on Twitch.tv, which I have done in the past, but I haven't done lately. And um, so they actually live stream Chris um, actually coding Prison Architect. And I saw that one day and I thought, oh, brilliant, I'll, keep it, I'll see what's going on. And uh, I am under the impression that what he was working on is, of course, going to be for Alpha 12. And I thought, you know what, I'll share what I have with you guys here today. So what we are looking at, um, I only know in detail uh, one of these aspects. But um, yeah, so the first thing we're going to be seeing is a contraband system. Now, we do know there are prisoners walking around, and that's what these metal detectors are for. That prisoners will, you know, be carrying around a knife or so when they come in, and you know, there'll be issues with that. Oh, I really need to get this sorted out, don't I? And, um, so prisoners will have, you know, a knife or, you know, whatever. And you see them walking around, and they get caught by these metal detectors. Now, what uh, Alpha 12 aims to do is they're going to have a system where you can obtain these um, illicit material from different parts of the prison based on, you know, what they are. So, for example, you could take knives, forks, and spoons from the serving table in, say, the canteen, but you wouldn't obviously find them in the psychologist's office. What you would find in the psychologist's office is things like mobile phones. Over in the infirmary, you would be able to get yourselves hands on some drugs. That's one thing I'm aware of, and there was a couple of few other things as well. It's actually been a few, um, probably... Yeah, about two weeks since I saw that uh, dedicated stream. But of course, you are more than welcome to go back to twitch.tv forward slash introversion software and take a look at what they've been working on. It is literally two hours of Chris coding. But um, yeah, if you're interested in seeing what's going on behind the scenes, uh, check them out. I'll, pro I'll put a link in the description for you. But um, contraband system, yeah, it's going to be very, very cool. Another thing as well, uh, they're going to try and make prisoners a little bit smarter. See how Pigeon kind of dodged the metal detector. Yeah, they're going to try and make it so that, if possible, prisoners will try to avoid metal detectors if they are carrying illicit materials such as uh, drugs, knives, forks, spoons, hammers, saws, things that are in the workshop. 
and uh, mobile phones and other things. So there probably is a potential that prisoners will try and sneak into the warden's office just to try and get his hands on some of the stuff that the warden has. But uh, a few things as well. Um, another thing to expect is our uh, hearses and escape tunnels. So that's going to be something that I don't. I can't. I can only speculate on what that is because I haven't seen that stream yet. But our hearse is obviously brought into Alpha 11. Potentially, there's a way to sneak out of the prison using hearses and escape tunnels as well. Uh, whether that's using large pipes, uh, it's kind of Andy Dufresne style. I'm watching you, buddy, wherever you are. Or whether it's, you know, something to do with. Um, uh, a new mechanic in itself, I don't know. But uh, that's definitely something I'm going to have to keep my eye on in this uh, upcoming update because things are going to get very, very difficult. And just linking back, finally, what I, the last thing I know about Alpha 12 is cell searching is also going to be a thing. Now, obviously contraband is going to be very, very difficult in this. Now, what they're going to have is a new version of, I think it's emergent, no, it's not emergency, what is it? Um, over here, so lock down and bang up. There's going to be a third one, and that's going to be called uh, Cell Search, something like that, something along those lines. And basically, while it'll, I believe it'll put them in lockdown, or whether you have to do it separately, whatever, uh, the guards will start searching the cells of all the prisoners and searching for contraband. Now, this all ties in pretty well with the fact that everything from, you know, the... Alpha 12 will all be related to contraband and escaping, so prison mechanics are about to get much harder in the next few days. But yeah, that's what you, what I expect to see in Alpha 12, and you should as well. So uh, they're just based uh, solely on what Introversion Software has been streaming on their Twitch TV channel and things that they've well explained. Uh, through that forum so you can have a look yourself and make the call for yourself um, unless uh, Something goes wrong and one of the mechanics isn't ready You may or may not see all these in alpha 12, but that's what I expect to see Nonetheless, let's get back to what's going on here. Gareth Headland is handling a iron upside down But that's okay because he's a prisoner uh, How is my solitary and all that gone so Medical beds on their way. I might just zone up the infirmary. So I'm going to zone that entire area up. Just so the doctors, when they're in there, can actually just wander between, you know, the hospital rooms. And it, it looks kind of good. Sorry if I keep bumping my microphone, by the way. It's right in front of my keyboard. But, um, yeah, I'm actually getting a new microphone as well. So I thought I should mention that. Uh, I'm getting a... What is it? It's an Audio-Technica AT2020 USB with a... A uh, pop filter and a microphone stand, all that cool stuff. It took me about three hours to organize because, you know, Amazon, you can't really uh, get it shipped to Australia very easily. So if you guys have Amazon and you complain about it all the time, don't take it for granted. You guys get stuff really cheap. And for people like me, Australian, you know, it's rather difficult to get your hands on that kind of stuff. So I've had to order all my stuff from probably three or four different areas. Uh, on the internet, so you know, should should look forward to, I should look forward to getting all that cool stuff. But uh, I'm expecting that to arrive during my uh, stay in Melbourne uh, over uh, Penny Arcade Expo. Oh, for God's sake, just got that fixed too. 